Hello guys, how are you? So today I'm glad to be launched the deep linking components from my own and uh, let's test it. So we have this uh, component uh, the demo where uh, I think some of you know about it where you, you can test my components and uh, I made a deep linking for it so let's test it on my device. It's working fine for iOS and Android and let's test it for android we go to the back handler we go into the component when let's go and see the twilio one we can go here and that's the twilio component let's go we have the clock component i just put three components no more but you can add as much as you want and let's go and why not search for component let's search for component this is a screen where we can search for component so you can see deep linking whatever so but the most important thing why don't we send the search data from here search like this let's say deep we search for the deep link component we click on it and here we go why don't we search for another component search for example for the uh, greeting component and yeah so how is that put in Adalo? so let's see so that's the component it's a very basic usage component here this uh, app i this is the actual app url here only appears in the editor doesn't appear any anywhere inside the app and we have only this actions here action when an event is triggered and this component demo is just the uh uri scheme here component demo so let's take an example here for some of them how did we put them so how did i go to the back handler so we add the back handler action and we make it that the url scheme plus as uh, host name is equal for the back handler so if i copy it here and paste and paste it here sorry paste it here I should go to the back handler component. Oops, sorry. I should go up to the back handler component. Here we go. And let okay, we have here ban the ban screenshot. Let's test it too. If we go here like this, this is the one which I used. If we go here back, we paste it here and we go we go to the screen component and uh, that's almost it so uh, for example for the change input value how did we make the search happen we click on uh, also it's a condition where the the url is equal to the search but the condition here we change the input value input of the uh, test input here we change it to the other parameter which is the extra parameters which comes after the question mark so that's almost everything we need to know about the deep linking component for now